It's the best environment in the Southeastern Conference to host the best regular season matchup with a lot on the table, Arkansas and Auburn. The emotions of senior night. Auburn and Arkansas will have to fight through that. Remember, this is an Auburn... The 40 minutes of hell that he's known for. Scotty Pullman, outstanding outside shooter, drains the tray. High with his athleticism to get it in. Jeffries. The first easy deuce belonging to the Californian quarter with a dump down to Njai. The extra pass right to Smith, and it's 72. But Tim, the number of the country in offensive rebounding. Razorbacks get a second shot. And Bradley, the senior, knocks down his first three in his home. There to follow is Smith. He does it all. There's Porter, a human pogo stick rejected by Jeffries. That's the block field goals there, but Steels is one of them. Jeffries, oh my! This kid's come to play tonight, Chris Jeffries. Oh, raise the roof. Defensive pressure picks up. Read the pick. Outlet to Hood in front of Porter. Again, Injai affected that shot. Bradley for three. Credit them. Sharp going to the left hand, not there. Brandon Dean with the push and pushing it real good. Back to Jeffries. And Brandon Dean for the Razorbacks. Walker. 19-18. Razorbacks. 11 minutes gone by in the opening half. Walker again. Gadney looked like he got hurt on that play. We'll have to watch that. Hood! I don't know if it was an alley-oop or just a shot he decided to dump in. New board, new offices, and uh, just a new look. Pat Bradley, that's an old look for fans of Arkansas, and it's a new record. All-time three-point shooting leader in the Southeastern Conference. His motor is always running. Walker. Boy, Walker has been outstanding from downtown. Two of them make it three of them, and it's 31-22. Porter's going to have to be a small forward in the NBA. He needs to work on his perimeter game. Speaking of perimeter game, Bradley again. He has four on the night. You're right. Sergio Teddy Gibson. Part of that Louisiana connection, he and Brandon Dean from Sportsman's Paradise. Fish back. Well, he's answered. He has certainly answered the back. Walker gives it right back to him. Smith in the game to throw the long out of bounds pass. Porter got it. What hands for three? to Porter to close out the half. And how about the pass by Abe Smith to get the halftime for the Tigers? Razorbacks lead by four against the second-ranked Tigers of Auburn. He's not up to contest him on those shots down low. Walker on the wing. Oh, he's lights out. 14 points for him. He starts the second half just where he ended the first. For Njai to finish with the dunk. Just a smart play. Good. Derek Hood, you cannot outwork him. Hood, the offensive rebound. Bradley. Senior to senior, serving it up again. Bradley decides to drive. Hood, the put back. Arkansas's got some. Hood again, and Walker again. If it's not one, it's the other. Now Chris Walker, who's playing tremendous. Just hustling all over the floor, making threes, and playing great defense as well. After Auburn, Smith and Njai. And for the first time, Hood fouled by Njai. So it's now Porter on the floor with Fishback and Smith. Reed got away with one. Robinson.
Robinson could not stay with him, and Kareem sort of pushed him aside. He Bradley and Kareem Reed. Hood with Gibson down there. Oofy, no! Raised the roof, Arkansas! against the Razorbacks. Gary Hood wanted this time the great feed from Reed. Unbelievable. Gibson actually with the feed. This brought the house down right here. How tough a game this really is. Nolan Richardson knew it. There's Brandon Dean. That's his first triple. Still hasn't hit that wing jumper. Porter tried to throw it off the shin, and it deflected inbounds, and Brandon Dean gets an easy one. It was really all Porter could do. He was on his way out of bounds. Ball just caromed incorrectly for him. Smith rejected by Joe Dean Davenport. And now a foul as Dean takes it away. Kareem Reed, a floater. They're just playing unbelievable, Cam. I don't know that anybody could come in here tonight and beat this team the way they're playing right now. Numbers, Dean. How about the Dean's list? Come out, Auburn. offense TJ Cleveland the good outlet look who's at the other end Hood who blocked the shot throws the ball to the rim Brandon Dean in the lane Walker <laughs> well we touched on it at halftime they were 9 of 13 from 3 he said if they kept that up they would win this game and uh... Reed inside the hood over in John too quick Walker for Bradley. Why? I don't know. Well, you're right, Joe. They've spread them out and gotten open shots all night long. They have. And when you get to the lane with the Chilius, that's the reason I say make one is because Chilius is a senior and he's from Little Rock. Oh, Jeffries! Boom shakalaka laka. Cleveland, Jeffries. You'd think that uh, Nolan Richardson would begin to get some of the seniors out and let them enjoy their final game. He is in the game out of the timeout. There's Hood. Fitting that that might be his last bucket at home. Outstanding shooting percentage because most of them are on putbacks or slam dunks. And the foul. Tim Arkansas has gotten more offensive team than I've seen all year. The dish, the feed, Auburn hasn't given up shots like that. Gilbert for three. He's an outstanding shooter. Add him to the tote board for the future. The youngster out of Mountain View. 104 83. And for anybody who's beaten Arkansas this year. Absolutely. Derek Hood. Kareem Reed. Pat Bradley. Lance Keeling, senior night, a success. Auburn knows it. The number two team in the country and the regular season champions spank in Arkansas tonight. For our entire crew with Jefferson Pilot Sports.